candle in the wind singer Elton John has a cameo in the next part of the explosive Harry and Meghan Netflix docuseries, it has been revealed. In the trailer for the second part of the six-part series the music legend is seen in photographs taken from Prince Harry and Meghan's wedding reception. In the trailer pictures from the wedding are interspersed with footage of the pair sat on a sofa talking about their first dance and how much fun they had with the guests who were celebrating with them. Meghan Markle said, I just really wanted the music to be fun. Even our first dance. But it is clear she cannot remember exactly what their first dance song was called and ruminates about whether it was called Song of a Thousand Dances and says she always gets it wrong. The royal family are said to be very nervous about the release of the final three parts of the documentary series, which are focused on the Sussexes' wedding, the birth of their firstborn Archie Harrison in 2019 as well as Meghan and Harry's decision to quit as senior royals. Sources fear there is a chance the program will become even more inflammatory than the first three episodes and will be targeted at the royal family. One source told The Times, next week will be poison. Despite being watched around the world, royal experts say the Netflix show hasn't gone down as well in the States as Meghan and Harry would have hoped, with many now turning their backs on the couple. Niall Gardner, a foreign policy expert and royal family enthusiast, praised the recent visit to the U.S. from Prince William and Kate. Princess of Wales, but believes Americans are now quickly turning against Harry and Meghan. He told Express.co.uk, the Prince and Princess of Wales had a hugely successful visit to the US. They are wonderful representatives for the royal family and British people. There is a massive difference in the grace from William and Kate compared to the deeply unpleasant vanity of Meghan and Harry. They are poles apart in terms of how they conduct themselves on the world stage. Mr. Gardner added, the future is in very safe hands with William and Kate, and the American people clearly love them. But the American people will begin turning against Meghan and Harry. They will be popular with the liberal left-wing elite but increasingly unpopular with the American people. They will become isolated in the US and will be as unpopular here as they are in the UK. Americans don't like vicious attacks on the royal family. The monarchy remains extremely popular in the US. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's Netflix documentary has sparked discussion across the globe, with three episodes still to come next week. The couple's first episodes looked at their romance and subsequent engagement and marriage, shedding light on how the couple felt as their lives changed. They spoke about racism, Meghan's first impressions of the royal family and Harry's late mother Princess Diana. The second half of Meghan and Harry's six-part documentary series is due to be released on December 15. Netflix confirmed on Monday, alongside a second trailer, that the bombshell show would be released in two parts.